it's Anne-Marie Hathaway and I'm Assistant Manager at The Fish at Wixford. The Fish is a brilliant place to visit. Um, there's a, a lovely garden area in the summer for people to sit and eat. Um, we've got a lovely varied menu. Um, it's a lovely quirky uh, pub if you go and have a look inside. Um, the staff are very friendly and helpful and we try and accommodate everyone's needs. It's located in a lovely rural area, um, about two miles from Binford on Avon, four miles from Alcester, and there's, um, I think it's about six miles from Stratford upon Avon as well. The beer is absolutely divine. We've got the local beer, we've got all sorts of ales and, and lagers. Uh, we're very proud of the food here. It's all cooked fresh. Um, the menu's varied, you know, for young and old and the children as well. We've got a nice menu. This is the garden area. Um, obviously, there's a play area for the children and there's a sand pit just by the river. They've got the river along da down there. Um, we have bonfire night as well. We do all sorts of things, have a bank holiday, all sorts of shenanigans. We've got a duck race in August. <laughs> Well, everyone usually ends up in the river. <laughs> uh, the landlord's dog's called Spider. Yes, he's um, um, a very um, athletic dog. He likes to jump in the river, whether it's rainy or shiny. <laughs> we do advise you book a table. <laughs> uh, but obviously, yes, you can see that it's beautiful and it's a lovely atmosphere. I'm Robin Ballinger and I'm the owner of Meadow Lane Bakery. Um, Meadow Lane Bakery is a traditional bakery on the high street in Bidford on Avon. We're a family business with myself, my wife, my two daughters and um, my cousin's daughter as well. Uh, we're very traditional, make things by hand, uh, make all our bread is all scaled and moulded by hand. We um, use quite a long dough process on our breads and um, we scale it all by hand and it's all moulded by hand and it's proved at a low temperature so it develops lots of flavour. The tea room in the bakery serves light bites like up to sort of a ploughman's lunch or a sandwich and toasted sandwich soup jacket potatoes, cream teas, that type of thing really, with, with nice coffee as well. Bidford's a lovely town uh, with lots of nice pubs, restaurants, a bakery, um, and um, it, it's just a lovely place to live. Bidford has a lovely sense of community. Most of our customers are all, are all regular and they like to use the local businesses as much as they can. My name is Patrick Marshall, owner of The Bridge. So I think people like The Bridge because it's a, it's a neighbourhood restaurant, it's a little local restaurant, people can just pop in here and have whatever they wish really, just a starter and a glass of wine or a full three course meal or celebratory dinner or whatever it is we try and supply so that uh, people feel that they can, we're ex accessible and um, available to everybody. Um, uh, we try to offer a broad range of uh, of fresh local produce on our menu. We use a lot of fish, we're, we're quite well known for our fish and um, seafood and um, we do quite often have sort of seafood and fish festivals where we'll do two or three days um, and, and try and make a big thing of it so people seem to enjoy that um, but we you know we we do all sorts of things so if you want a burger or fish and chips we do those if you want something a bit more um, fine dining we do that as well. We do have an amazing location and especially when the weather is, is great then you can't really beat being by the river like this and uh, we do get the odd boat mooring up um, now and again but it, it is a, a fantastic location. You could be anywhere really. Um, so Bidford is, is a small village, well located near to Stratford-upon-Avon obviously which is a huge tourist hub. Um, but also very well located in terms of getting anywhere in the Midlands really because we're so near to the motorways, um, main arteries that lead up to Birmingham and, and so on and so forth. Birmingham Airport's very nearby. Um, so it, it, it's a well located place for commuters as well as people who want to actually enjoy the village for, for its, its village life. I think the sense of community is very good. It's, uh, it, it is only a small place um, but you know people do uh, I think enjoy living here. It's, it, it's got a good community feel to it.